Take this to your dyer later. An old Utaru trailhead. Looks like this is where the rite of discovery started. Debris on the trail. That looks like pieces of a bridge. Looks like this fell down here a long time ago. Maybe from a storm. The trail's broken away. Kalai must have climbed her way up, too. If Kalai made it to the top, she must have been a good climber. It doesn't add up that she fell. This must be the promontory. Looks like Kalai was doing something at that stone table. I should take a look. ground into a dye. Kalai must have done this as part of her ritual. I should look around. My focus will help me figure out what happened to her. I was playing song, just like the first Utaru saw it. The search party was up here, all right. There's too many tracks to pick out Kalai's. Looks like the edge broke off recently. I still don't think she could have fallen into the river from here. I should keep looking around. Uh, pack's full, but my stash has room. These flowers have a trace of something on their petals. The dye Kalai was wearing. Looks like it left a trail. Too faint for the search party to have noticed, but my focus can pick it up. There's the dye trail. Looks like it leads away from the cliff edge. Dye trail ends here, with a lot of broken branches. I should take a closer look. Dyer can make use of this. Branches were snapped off recently. From some kind of struggle? And over here, drag marks. It looks like they lead through this thicket. I can follow them with my focus. Two bodies? One must be Kalai, but who's the other woman? Kalai. Those marks on her neck. She was strangled. 
At least I can return her seed pouch to Bree. So the killer must have tried to push Kalai off the cliff. That's why the search party found her instrument by the river. But Kalai fought back. So the killer strangled her. And then dragged her here. something other than fire. over just yet. Thank you. 
fight's over just yet. Killer seat pouch. Might help identify her. Maybe I can trade this green shine. Maybe Fane and Cal back in Plainsong will know who the seed pouch belongs to. This might have been the way the first Utaru climbed down the mountain. Looks like most of the path has crumbled away. Lament Kalei's death, but perhaps it's time to move on. No, not until I hear from Aloy. That's Kalei's. You found it. Bree. Kalei didn't fall. She was murdered. What? I went up to the promontory. I found Kalei and... The body of the woman who killed her. That's impossible. The, the search party already checked up there. There was nothing. The bodies were in a separate clearing. Away from where the search party checked. A stalker had mauled her. While she was trying to hide Kalai's body. Who was she? I was hoping you would know. I brought back her seed pouch. Belongs to Lina, Kel's apprentice. I don't understand. Why would she do this? Maybe we should ask Kel. But she... You, there. Where is Kel? I saw her leave out the East Gate about an hour ago. She's going home. Summer wind. She's running away? She needs to stand trial. I can catch her. Where is this place? 
Look for a ruined settlement at our southern border. It's her childhood home. We will get the guards and try to catch up with you. place for a machine. Uh, must be cleansing out on the signal. That must be summer wind. That fire's cow. Once you went up that cliff, you stood right next to the man whose wife you had murdered and told him to move on. I never wanted any of this to happen. Then why? Calais sowed the seeds of discord. She wanted the Utaru to leave Plainsong, abandon our home. If that thought caught on, it would have been more destructive than any sickness or machine. So you had her killed? There is a natural order to all things. Growth, decay, death. It's the way of the world. The tree cannot pick up its roots, so I stopped what was threatening us. And I'm sorry it came to it, but it's over now. I'm gonna make sure you pay for all the suffering you've caused. Too late. You think you stopped Kalai's beliefs from spreading? But when people hear what you did, they'll cast aside the old ways even more. No. And you won't be around to do anything about it. No! She needed to stand trial! Kalai deserves justice! Kel thought that silencing Kalai would silence her beliefs. Prove her wrong. That will give Kalai justice. It isn't much, but... I want you to have this. As thanks. I won't have to spend the rest of my days wondering what happened to Kalai. Blighted are the leaves. Three of our people, dead. And for what? I admit it. I never wanted you among us. But now, it seems I must thank you for revealing the rot that had taken hold here. I'm sorry it had to happen this way. At least with the rot removed, new growth can thrive. I'll make sure Kel's body is properly seen. Kel's treachery will be a shock to many in Plainsong. You've done enough for us, Outlander. Go while the roots are strong. I'll make sure Kel's body is I'll properly plant Kalai's seed pouch in Plainsong. You made that possible. 
Kel's treachery will be a shock Kel to many. would have gotten away with murder. If not for you, Aloy. You've done enough I'll for us. I'll always be grateful you exposed Kel's Go treachery. Go, the roots are strong. <laughs>